Are you ready to find out what the crypto market has in store for us this week? Let's dive into the latest market trends and predictions to see what's knowing in. That's when we know one of the most exciting things happening in the crypto world is the bullish bias for Ethereum. With the recent halving event, the market conditions have shifted to chop and range formations, making it more difficult to predict price movements. However, speculators are expecting bullish returns in the near term, so it's definitely worth keeping an eye on the Ethereum. On the other hand, Bitcoin is still in the consolidation phase, with a revisit to $60,000 growing more likely. Traders are going through a tough period after the easy pieces of rallies we've seen since last October but there are still opportunities to be found. So what are the next liquidity pockets that could attract prices? Let's take a look at the seven day liquidation heat map for Bitcoin. We see a bright cluster of liquidations in the $60,000 area with 61.810 and $63,000 being the next bullish targets. Similarly, on the 5th of May, we saw prices jump above the 64K mark to collected liquidity before a brutal short-term reversal. Um, in the case of Ethereum, there is a cluster of liquidity nearby to the north at $29.50, which is close to the current market price of $29.28. A dip into the $28.60 rejection would likely present a buying opportunity. The liquidation levels around the 3.1 to 3.2K area presents an attractive target with a drop below 2.8, heralding a strong short-term downtrend. Uh, so what does this all mean for traders? Well, it's definitely uh, a time to be cautious and set your stop losses accordingly. Um, however, if you're willing to take on some uh, risk, buying the dip to the $50, the 60 to 60, the $60 region for Bitcoin, or the $28.60 region for Ethereum uh, could pay off in the long run. Um, and with that said, thanks for watching. And uh, until next time, remember to always do your own research and never invest more than you can afford to lose.